In the GPC for a raw squat, you're allowed wrist wraps, belt, knee wraps or knee sleeves. You can find the spec for these in your GPC rulebook that was emailed to you when you got your membership. So, the head referee will give you the following commands, squat and rack. Um, I'll do a little demo here of what they squat. look and sound like. Rack. Okay, so squat and rack. Here we've got Larice uh, squatting out of the monolift, which we do in the GPC. You're not allowed to walk out, so you'll just stand up, get your feet in position, stand up, squat down, return back, you'll get a rack command, and in you go. So she stands up, her hips are locked, and her knees are locked. She gets a squat command, she squats down, comes back up, rack command, and back in. So here we've got it in slow motion. So when she stood up out of the racks, her hips were locked and her knees were locked. She gets a squat command. She squats down into her squat until the crease of her hips is below the top of her knee. And then she returns to standing until her knees are locked out, hips are locked out. She'll get a rack command and she'll rack the bar again. So here we see her crease of hip below the top of the knee. So let's go through it. She'll get a squat command. She squats down, returns and rack. In she goes. See it from the front. So this is the um, view that your referee will have. Squat, rack. So nice and simple, really, really just two commands. There are a few different causes for getting red lights. The main ones are failure to observe the referee's uh, signals. Don't double bounce or let the bar go down when you're coming back up out of your squat. Make sure that your hips and your knees are locked out when you start and finish. No stepping out of the racks or moving your feet in between um, the commands. Uh, make sure that you are uh, always in control of the bar, so no dumping of the bar. There's a couple of others there that you can just read through at your own leisure. Um, you know that I'm available for coaching services, so if there's anything more that you want to know, just find me an email over and we'll see what we can do. Hope you enjoyed that video and I'll do some more soon.